So what is going on guys? This is Ryan here and today I wanted to play a wonderful game not based on anything to do with horror because we all love beautiful fun family based games don't we? Today's video is going to be on a game called Hungry Lamu. Lamu is very hungry. Explore the forest for living fruits and feed Lamu to fill up that big stomach. I, I don't know what this warning is all about guys. I, I don't think it means anything. So Dev no first horror game. Oh. Wait, first horror game? I thought we was playing a fun little friendly family game. What's, What's going, going on? on? So what is going on, guys? This is Ryan here, and welcome to a game called Hungry Lamu. I have little to no idea about this game. All I know is that it's kind of messed up, kind of spooky. Wait, hold up. I'm just looking at this shadow here. Is that something there? This is one of those games that looks super friendly on the front, but of course, it's probably got super dark connotations attached. Like Amanda the Adventure, you know, all those other kind of games that do a similar thing. Andy's Apple Farm, you know, ticks a box. Hungry Lamu, yeah, we throw that in the same pile. A little monster in the shadow. Yeah, we'll come in and see exactly what you are. Let's play this thing. I'm ready for the horrors. Uh, hello, Labu. You had a good nap, didn't you? Oh dear, looks like somebody's hungry. Let's go find some food for that big stomach of yours, Lamu. Hey, we're in the game. This is Lamu, look at this thing. Hey, why you got human teeth? If you guys enjoyed this episode, I think you know exactly what to do. We're gonna get going with this thing. We are Lamu. We walk around this place. Uh, are we in like a cave or something? Why don't we come down here? Like, wait, I'm stuck. Hold up. Go to our left. Go to our right. What are we trying to observe down here? So far, I'm stuck down here in some kind of weird cavern. I don't see any way out. Uh, okay, I found my directional way out. Look at this thing in the bushes. Isn't it a beautiful day, Lamu? Let's find some cherries to put in that stomach of yours. Objective, eat three cherries. A nice simple objective. So, I see some blueberries on the tree right there. Eat, eat the cherries. The oh, cherries? Whoa, headbutt the cherries more like. They're kind of vicious though, Lamu, I'm just saying. Lovely family friendly game for us all to enjoy together. So this is all we do. Okay, all right, Naruto, we get you. We get you directing us where to go, what the freak? Okay, so we look around for the cherries. Uh, hey, Naruto, I don't see no more. So do we go back? We can't go back in the cave. Okay, this dude, what are you talking about? Where the cherries are? Okay, I think the boundary box is just to our left. So, or to our right. Hey, cherries, let's go. <laughs> Objective, eat one more lot of cherries. Okay, we'll go ahead and find that thing probably down here. Look at that. What was I just saying, huh? Yum. Weren't those cherries delicious? But Lamu is still hungry. Cherries are not enough for Lamu's what? stomach. What? Oh, what's that? Wait, what, what are we seeing? What? Well, if it isn't a cute little banana. A cute little sentient banana. I don't want to eat that thing, actually. Lamu loves fruits. I'm sure this banana wouldn't mind helping Lamu. Let's go meet this banana, Lamu. Okay, as long as it means when we meet him, Lamu's instinct is not to just consume his soul straight up. Let, let's be nice. Hold on, what's this? Take rock? Wait. What, what do I have a rock in my hand? Hold up. Talk to banana. Sure. Hello, little banana. Kind of vicious, not gonna lie. Okay, now kind of cute barking up. Oh dear, looks like I was wrong. The banana is very selfish and doesn't want to help Lamu. Barking away, we'll need to make the banana sleep so that Lamu can have a del delicious... Do we, should we do this? The banana won't let Lamu pass. What's he about to do? What are you gonna do, sir? I'm eight times the size of you, four times the mass, probably 14, actually. I think the announcer's making up his own rules right now, guys. So it's like the announcer is directing Lamu to do some weird crap, so... But... <laughs> Hearty meal. I'm sure Banana didn't mind. Despite its sour attitude, it tasted very sweet. However, there's still some space in Lamu's big stomach. Oh, what's that, Lamu? Oh my. No, God, Bro, please, it's a bunch no. of fruits no. having a camping no. session. It's a bunch of fruit friends. We don't see a lot of them around here. Their fruits should be enough to. No. Let's go say hi. Bro, we ain't gonna say hi. We're gonna say, oh, I'm gonna take you out. Wait, what's this? Take the. Guys, this is this is actual real. <laughs> Wait, we go oh. up to the motor. <laughs> oh, they run! They str okay, they've got the right idea. They should have run. Looks like they want to play a game, just like the other fruit friends we've met in the past. How fun! Come on, Lamu, let's find our new friends. So we can have some of their delicious fruit. <laughs> Lamu, you have a choice right now to stop this, but still, you continue. Oh my, throw bees. Oh, 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 ouch, the bees stung me everywhere. <laughs> Looks like I've got to be careful next time. Dude's in agonizing pain, but still cracks a joke. Have my apple, you deserve it. <laughs> Bro, I just ate the apple's forehead and his chin. Hey, oh, I see eyes in a bush. Need something hot. Hot? Wait, what do you mean? Hold on, we about, yo, this is like, 
This is mean. Hey, let, let's go. Oh, let's go. Hey, buddy, hiding in the tree. We see you. We're so friendly. Look, we bring the light in case it gets dark. And uh, we toss you up. Oh, what the freak? That's hot, hot, hot. Oh, jeez. Couldn't you try something less burning? Well, I hope you like burn pad because it's all your... Why do they give themselves up like this after? You, I don't get it. Uh, your head is gone in my belly. Okay, why do the fruits give themselves up? The this is about to get real bad. A hey, uh, remaining fruit, let me ask you a question. You know what I'm saying? Wait, uh, smash the... What? Am I breaking this down so no one can escape? Okay, this is kind of messed up the more I think about it. Lamo, you're jacked up, man. You are jacked up. Your past is something I need to know about. What have you done? Oh man, we take down the tree. We take down the- Oh, he's dead, he's dead. Wow, that was a high fall. Did you know oranges give you tons of energy? Have mine, maybe next time you'll be able to climb it. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Weren't your fruit friends just delicious, Labu? What a great day, playing with friends, eating delicious fruits, and having such fun. Today was a marvelous day, wasn't it, Labu? Yeah, we only ranked up four kills. Bro, he fades me out. Oh? What's that, Lamu? You're still hungry? Lamu, just have a... Wait. What the hell? Sounded like Tasha. I told them not to make so much ruckus. Let's see what they're up to. Wait, what? <gasps> okay, yo, hold up, hold up. Okay, this game just changed up. So, we see as Lamu, everything is fruits. They're actual people, though. Wait, what is Lamu? Is Lamu like a murderer or something? Killing pe- Oh my god, guys. It's like a front. But deep down, this is what Lamu has been doing. Is he being controlled by the narrator or something to believe this fantasy world? Look, the tents, man, we see them. They're all barren as heck. Where did they all go? Where's Mochi? Mochi, where are you, girl? She couldn't have run off to- Is Mochi the banana? Oh my gosh, no. Oh my gosh. This game's about to make me feel terrible. I don't want to go through this forest. I know what I'm going to find. Follow the path. Mochi, come on, buddy. Let's get you out. Please tell me I was just imagining things. I don't think she would run off this way. Yo, bro, how do you know that, huh? How do you know that? Okay, we look around the forest. Hey, Mochi, go. Come on, let's uh, let's get you back to the camp. Let's get you to safety. I'm not going to lie. This fog is kind of hard to see through, and this flashlight's weak as freak. Wait. Oh, <gasps> no way. Bro, what the freak? M M Mochi? What the crap? Who did this? Poor girl. Whichever of you assholes did this, this is messed up! Tasha, Ken, Leon, where the heck are you guys? Bro, this is... Okay, we're gonna find the... We know we're gonna find three more corpses, but this dude, uh, he has no idea. I shouldn't go any deeper. You have no idea. Oh my gosh. So, the front for this game is not the truth at all. Bro, like, a ban what were we seeing? These are like bananas and such. Why? I, I don't get it. And we smashed the car up too. So this character, he's not going to be able to escape, right? He's going to be looking around, trying to escape down the line. We messed him up. We messed him up. Whoa. What the freak? Yo, I don't get what's going on with this game. I don't. I'm hearing noise. I'm hearing so much noise around me. I don't know what to do. The tree that was taken down. Oh my gosh, no way, dude. Are we gonna find a body ne Dude, I don't like this at all. There is something else going on here. There's no evidence of a body? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh. Tasha, she must have twisted her leg in the- What? What the heck did this- Whoa, whoa, hey! Hey, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. What is going on? Oh, guys, I don't know what's going on. Yo, I'm paranoid, this freak. I am paranoid, guys. I really am. I don't- so I can hear over there now. Oh, I don't know where I'm going. We know we gotta find bodies. Wait. Whoa. 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 What the freak was that? Was that the, the Lamu thing? Okay, I'm expecting a jump scare. I ain't gonna lie. I'm getting freaked out. I need to find the others first. Bro, skip them. Look over there. Over there. There's something right there. We can't go over there. Guys, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. Find your two fr- Wait. What the- oh my gosh. We got a burning body coming up. Dude, there is something literally running around the forest. <coughs> oh, holy crap! I don't even recognize him! He's burnt! What the heck is going on? Dude, this is so jacked up. This whole situation is jacked up. And we still got another friend to find. This is gonna get worse. Skip your running. Skip your running. That's Lamu! 
I saw it that time. That's bro. Okay, Lamu is gonna kill us. They're gonna eat our intestines and then probably wear us as a necklace. I don't know where our last friend was. I'm trying to find them. Wait, the rocks. They were hiding under the rocks just here, and Lamu found them. Bro, they got flies around them. They must smell before even death. Oh, I'm gonna be sick. Why are there so many dang bees? Who did this to you, Ken? I have to get out of here. I need to get to. Oh, and we smashed the car. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, we've we've screwed this guy up so bad. He has no idea. He ain't getting out. Dip through the campfire. Just follow this little bit of dirt path we got, showing that someone else has been walking here. This is our only lifeline to get out of the forest. Is it actively stalking me, or is it just like... Yo, look at that. Standing there behind that tree, and I'm seeing you so clear as day, man, even though we're in the nighttime. All right, I see you. I see you, Lamu. Maybe the light kind of takes it away. Look, standing behind the tree. We see that there. It's becoming much more like clingy to us the closer we get to the exit. No, no, you don't. No, you don't. I don't even know how we fend ourselves off against this thing. I I'm strictly just kind of looking at it when I see it like there. We see it in the distance. You know, do we finally go over to this thing here? There's the car, but little do we know, it is not going to be operational. Whoa. It's looking steaming up, bro. Oh my gosh. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What now? What are we going to do? Lamu Forest Park. Wait. The car's busted? Who the heck is doing this? <laughs> ah! Look at his tubby or belly, bro. Why is it full to the brim? I take full responsibility for that one. I can't say any other way. Ending two of two full course meal. And you know, that's because this dude, he got the whole gang. He took out the whole squad on that one. And we could have prevented that had we not destroyed the car. So that makes me want to go back and not destroy the car and see what happens. Wait, what's this? You see it behind the tree? But I can't interact with this. I can't swing. That feels like a little bit of a secret, but I don't know. Hey, what the freak are you? Watching in the distance behind the trees? I didn't see that last time. You see, behind none of the other trees, we don't have that. Maybe there's uh, a certain thing we can use with that? Yeah, let me eat your forehead though, sorry. Okay, so we eat the pear. We know, yeah, we know what you deep down are doing, okay? This is not good. So we didn't destroy the car this time, so this gives us an out. We should be able to escape. Let's go. Lamu's still hungry, but too bad. Lamu forgot to break the... Didn't forget to break that guy, but not me. So I found all three of the bodies now. So the next step is getting to the car. Um, I don't know what was wrong with me. I, I could literally not find my last friend's body. Should have just left after seeing the first two and assumed the worst. Whoa. Wait, whoa, did you see that? He started to turn a bit red when we got near Lamu, but then he just instantly outed. Let's try that again. So we get close. You see it goes red like that? And then he disappeared. Why? What are you trying? Are you trying to stalk me without me seeing you or something? Still not. Whoa, whoa. Okay, you just teleported right on top of me practically that time. So we see the fire. We know this is the direction for our car. It ain't broken this time. Yeah, we're leaving this time, Lamu. You can keep your little park. Get away from my car, buddy. I got places to get. Okay, stop with the redness. I'm so close to victory right now. In my car. Woo. You better lock those doors, sir. Handbrake down, foot to the ground. We drive away. You better be going to the police station. Uh... <laughs> I heard a splat after that better have been our car impacted him with its body. Hold up. Roadkill ending one of two. Tragedy in Lamu Forest Park. Tragedy strikes in the infamous Lamu Forest Park. What was supposed to be a peaceful camping trip of four friends turned into a devastating bloodbath. Tasha, Ken, uh, Leon, and someone else, presumably us, were camping in the Lamu Forest Park on the night of February 19th. The young adults just graduated and they were looking to just get away out into the wild to unwind and relax. That was when the tragedy occurred. Tasha, Ken, and Leon were brutally murdered and decapitated in the middle of the night, leaving us, I guess, to be the lone survivor of the devastating incident. The Lamu Forest Park has been infamous due to its collection of known murders to those who enter the park. Every murder involved within the park has been through decapitation by unknown means. Though forensics have concluded that by marks present on the deceased bodies resemble that of human teeth. So Lamu does have human teeth, what the freak? The mystery of the Lamu killer has been solved. Has, has been solved due to the recent developments? Though authorities have decided to withhold the information of details about said killer, they assure the public that there will no longer be any cause for harm to any citizens. Redacted has refused to participate in any interviews, understandably due to their traumatizing experience. Our deepest condolences to the family of Tasha Neal, Ken Abel, and Leon Dean. The public may rest easy knowing the Lamu killer has been apprehended. So, what was it? A person? Was it an actual, like, we saw, was it a llama or something? Like, what's actually happening here? We see the picture there, Lamu Forest Park, and we go back to the menu and let me guess guys 
it still tries to pass off as an innocent freaking game. So if the killer has been apprehended with their wording choice, I don't know if that's hinting towards Lamu being a killer of some kind. Maybe some kind of mutant human-like thing. Maybe it's just a human who stalks in the Lamu park and the hungry, it's like their hunger for blood and killing more people. So I'm not sure. The game could be presenting the Lamu and the like narrator as like the voice is telling him to go take people out. I, I don't really know. Either way, guys, that was Hungry Lamu, a very, very interesting take. Like it gives itself that appearance of that cutesy little game where you're going to have fun playing this thing and it turns out to be a pretty traumatic and disturbing game. Let me know what you guys think about this down below. Maybe I've got the entire plot of this thing wrong. You guys can shed some light if you wish. For this one though, that was Hungry Lamu and I really hope you guys did enjoy this quirky and bizarre little game. If you did, why not drop me that like crane? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here. So thanks so much for watching this video, guys. Of course, I hope you did enjoy. And if you ever go near Lamu Forest Park, you better put your foot down on that pedal and accelerate away.